Here's your field for race number 11, the second elimination for Illinois bred two year old pacing Colts and Gulling. Number one is LT's Wind Dancer, owned by Larry Fenn and Trudy Beaver at Newton. Fred Fenn Jr. will drive. Two is Extreme Sport, owned by HBH Standard Bridge Incorporated of Warrenville. Homer Hochstetler will drive. Three is Cabanero, owned by the Limp Harrises of Palos Park in Naperville. Doug Hamilton driving. Number four, the world champion, Minnie Me, owned by Bob and Linda Greider and Roger and Don Sampson of Illinois. Dave McGee will drive. Number five is Kinnon's Billy, owned by Ken Spurlock of Dyer, Indiana. Dale Heitman driving. Number six will be Fox Valley Crest, owned by Don Krilling in Northbrook. Howard Zimmerman of Wilmet. Brent Holland will drive. Number seven is Sports Bar, owned by R.H. and M.K. McGee of Lyle. Rick Schrock of Springfield, Rick Schrock driving. At number eight, Nick J. Cole, owned by Allen and Jackie Bowen of Mount Sterling. Ron Lane in the Monmouth. Neil Coleman will drive. Gates on the move. Here they come. They're off and pacing from the outside. That's Nick J. Cole driving out to get the lead. Extreme Sport on the inside, along with LT's Wind Dancer. Then we got Cabanero dropping over fifth now is Mini Me. Two-year-old pacing Colts race into the first turn. Extreme Sport and Homer Hockstetler lead them there. On the outside, Nick J. Cole is still second. LT's Wind Dancer is racing third. Cabanero's back there fourth. Then a gap of about four lengths back to the world champion Mini Me, followed in the inside now by Keenan's Billy. Then we've got... Uh, Fox Valley Christian Sports Bar at the back. Off the quarter in 28 seconds flat. The leader, Extreme Sport, by about a length. LT's Wind Dancer sets their second. Cabanero is still racing third. Nick J. Cole is fourth. And Minnie Me just tips from five for McGee. Minnie Me is out and driving. He was fifth. Now moves up to be fourth on the outside as they race down the back stretch. Off a quarter in 28 seconds flat. It's Extreme Sport by a length and a half. But here comes Minnie Me. Was fifth then fourth, then third. Now he's second on the outside as they race past the half mile marker in 58 and four fifths of a second. It's Extreme Sport on the inside. Mini Me on the outside drives up. He takes over now for Dave McGee, the new leader, the world champion, Mini Me, as they race into the final turn. Extreme Sport is racing the second. LT's Wind Dancers third. Nick J. Cole is fourth on the inside. Moving up now fifth is Fox Valley Chris as they race over to the three quarter mile marker. Mini Me by a length and a half. Extreme Sports still there second. The three quarters in 127 and three. He ought to have a lot left. Pretty soft fractions for this world champion. It's Mini Me by a length. It's still Extreme Sport along the inside. On the outside, uh, moving up just a little bit now is a Keenan's Billy. Eighth of a mile to go. Mini Me is going to have to be caught. Extreme Sport on the inside. Keenan's Billy on the outside. LT's Wind Dancer and Fox Valley Chris, but Mini Me's coasting. Mini Me. Gets an easy one here, wins by three in 154 and three. Extreme Sport, Keenan's Billy was third. LT's Wind Dancer hung on for fourth. He's the fastest two year old pacer ever bred in the state of Illinois. Previous mark had been by the Philly, the great world champion Philly, incredible Tilly, 151 and four fifths of a second. The fastest mile by a two-year-old Illinois bred pacing gelding had previously been 152 and uh, two-fifths by Hot Chili Pepper. But Minnie Me startled the harness racing world last week with a mile at Balmoral Park in 150 and four-fifths of a second with a final quarter in 26 and four. And he keeps his unbeaten streak alive here today with a relatively easy victory in 154 and three, last quarter and 27 seconds flat. The kind of mile I'm sure that trainer Roger Welch wanted here this afternoon to keep the Colts sharp for the rich final next week.
As you can see, this Colt has raced from off the pace in each one of his starts. He has a spectacular burst of speed. And people are starting to think that this might be the best horse ever bred in the state of Illinois. Only time will tell, but he's the fastest two-year-old of pacer ever in Illinois. The world champion two-year-old of painting gelding. And he's now six for six is Roger Welch, the very capable trainer of many me. Joins National Hall of Famer Dave McGee in the winner's circle, folks, with Minnie Me. Let's give him a big hand. Roger Welch with Bob and Linda Griner and Roger and Don Sampson. Minnie Me, the winner of race 11 here in 154 and 3, last quarter in 27 seconds flat. Many Me, another son of Incredible Finale, and again, Incredible Finale stands at the Walker Farms in Sherman, Illinois. A whole bunch of Incredible Finales will sell Sunday afternoon at their farm sale. It's a beautiful venue there at Sherman. 